recently on stream I've been trying to get as many tiny houses done in Happy Home Paradise as possible. I'm doing them all 4x4 build and trying to make it look good even though it's kind of hard with such a tiny home. I've been doing it this so that I can get through Happy Home Paradise quickly because I want to get to 30 houses on my new island and it's the quickest way without just dumping the furniture I find. So today on stream we were finishing up the last few houses to get to 30 and I was pulling random amiibos out of my folders or things like that just to randomize who we were making homes for and Ricky showed up. Ricky if you don't know him he's a squirrel he's got some pretty intense eyebrows but he wanted a medical facility of some sort at his home like a medical historian or something I can't remember the exact name but I then found out that his catchphrase is a word that I don't know about you but for me personally I don't think it's an appropriate term to use so I was kind of surprised to hear a villager using this name for me so I kind of went creepy with this hospital build just out of pure spite because I didn't like him using that term what as the build comes together I've cut it into a shorter video so it's a little bit easier to watch uh, and just make sure you keep watching because things very much derail at the end and <laughs> I kind of lose it on stream and I'm it's, it's just so funny you could have watched <laughs> I found it funny anyway you'll see what I mean stay fresh cheese bags bye all right, let's give you your tiny 4x4 creepy hospital. Let's make the hospital creepy purely because he called me a nutcase. <laughs> we should have like bones on the floor, right? It's just, I don't want to go that far because of the, I don't want to like, I don't want to like be, um, yeah, that would just cause, uh, stereotyping and stuff that I don't want to go down. But instead, we're just going to give him something horrible. <laughs> What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give him like this with a desk here and it, like he's doing some like weird story stuff with this. Something we do have to do is just go outside and change the time of day. Make it night time. It's gonna be night time, right? It's, it's gonna be as dark and creepy as, po as creepy as possible. There we go. I hate this massage chair. It creeps me out so he's getting that. <laughs> I assumed he would have the security camera in here. I just assumed it was going to be there. <laughs> have I even got it yet? Don't tell me I don't have the security. I do, yes. I mean, like, I feel like this boat's just asking for it. Oh, yes. Oh, we're going to put some tools somewhere. Just to add to the creepiness of this place. That could be next to his fax machine. Quite low on the ground, but that's okay, he's short. And I want to put, um, what else do I want? I went one of these wall clots because they just scream to me, creepy hospital. <sighs> I'm gonna do it. not gonna ask about that one. Oh, where have I put the bones? Have I got the bones? I hope so. I might put a mop instead <laughs> if I don't have the bones. Have I got anything that I can put hanging down? Oh, he's clapping at a fluorescent light. That's kind of sad, mate. <laughs> And I'll move that over to here. Okay, let's put that sound back in. Oh, the lighting! I hate how it does that. There we go. I want it dark. Okay, I kind of love this now. <laughs> I wish I could change that to like... Just a few things to a bit older, but oh no, I need to change his outfit. We need to give him, I hope I've got the lab coat. Or something similar. Do I want to give him the doctor's coat? It almost seems too professional. He has to have that black tie. 
The rubber apron! <gasps> yes. Or oh, give him the ripped doctor's coat. I love the blue on him as well, <laughs> but I'm going to try a couple of other colors, like the white. Nah, the blue's the best. <laughs> he couldn't find anyone to like, to go to test on, so he's had to use himself. Okay. <laughs> I'm unsure about the reflector on him, but I kind of like... <gasps> That's the one. That is the look. <laughs> You regret looking back just at this moment. I'm gonna try the eye patch, but I think I mean that's kinda good, but I think this <laughs> his mouth Hi everybody! <laughs> Hi Dr. Nick! <laughs> oh, I was too late. too late. The halls of medicine, medicine. <laughs> We're hardly focusing his face. <laughs> Why has he got his back to us the whole time? Come on, turn around. He's just hiding his face the whole time. Did I rec Oops. Oh, that was the wrong button. I meant to do that. <laughs> it was too slow. But I'm gonna have to watch that watch that again at some point. Oh my gosh. Oh boy, nine out of ten <laughs> Do you just recommend. <laughs> totally does. Should we take some photos? <laughs> Can I blame him? He's ashamed. This one's just one big oops, right? Um, have I got like something that a patient would wear? <laughs> What's the bet that when I get out of this, he's already up and walking around somewhere else? As they tend to do. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. Oops, oops, no, no, he's gonna get up and walk around and I'm panicking. What is that noise? Oh, it's the massage chair. He's charging. <laughs> <laughs> just the, ba the betas of the massage chair just wait. <laughs> That's why he's got the panda, just because of the massage chair. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that, but I gotta keep it. <laughs> That's not shocked. Whoa, whoa. Can I walk any further? I can't go, okay. <laughs> His eyebrows blinking behind the 
glasses is so funny. Watch it. Just watch his eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Oh wait, I need to talk to him. I just turned his laptop off. I'm gonna have to move him to talk to him. 